Hey guys, it's Jocelyn, Couponing Mama on a Mission. So this was my haul for the week of 5-5 to 5-11. As you guys know, I'm back. We just got back from Florida, so it's been like crazy town all the last um, few days. And I was not going to do CVS this week. So this video is kind of pointless because um, we're on to new deals tomorrow or today. It's And happy Mother's Day, everybody, because it's actually past midnight. So Savings Baby is um, just turned one on Wednesday and last Wednesday, excuse me, and has been teething and is cutting like four teeth all at once. Ridiculous. Plus um, on Friday and today's Saturday, well, technically Sunday morning, um, he had all of his one year shots. So he had three shots and then they did his heel pick, they tested for lead and all that. So yeah. I was not going to go do a haul at all at CVS this week. Then I looked over my um, ECBs and seen that one of them expired um, on the 11th, which is today. So I had a $7 ECB, an $8 ECB, and a $9 beauty buck. Um, I think I had $24 total to start with. And I was like, yeah, it was my $8 one that was set to expire today. Because I haven't gone for the last couple weeks because we were in Florida for two weeks. And then we've had like three and four lacrosse practices a week. And then we have two games on Sunday and keeping up work schedules and everybody's appointments and trying to catch up and everything. It's just been crazy. So anyway, I did sit down. So I guess like the point of this video is if you're new to um, couponing CVS, I'll just give a couple quick savvy tips. We won't go over like exactly what insert each coupon came out of. I'm going to skip that part just because, like I said, that part's kind of pointless. Um, a lot of these deals repeat themselves, guys. So, like, the spend threshold on the Aleve is, like, spend 30, get 10. And they're buy one, get one 50% off right now. I'm sure that's repeating this week. The Colgates are always the same. The Essentials are $4.99. Or not always. But, you know, quite often it might skip a week, but they often go back to the same and reset. Colgate Essentials is $4.99. When you buy one, you get a $2 extra buck. These Colgate Total SFs, make sure if you guys get them, you get the SF, which is Stain Fighter. Um, and I got a 3.4 ounce, so it's usually 3.4 to 4 ounce ones. They are $3.49. The reason I'm saying to make sure you get the SF or Optic White, because I, in particular, these FFs, are the only one if you go so if you're brand new shopping at CVS which I was like less than two months ago I started end of February shopping at CVS uh, last week of February was my first week so I'm brand new as well if you go on to the CVS.com say you don't have an extra care card I did not I just went on to CVS.com um, went to register registered got a new account uh, asked that they send me a card, got a number, signed up, and was able to start clipping coupons to my account that day that I was issued a card number and did my sign up and my registration. So yeah, just go sign up on cbs.com and or hit extra care and then sign up, excuse me. So first thing I do when I know I'm going to do CVS deals is I go through the CVS flyer and I get me a piece of paper and I jot down the deals that are of interest. So let's just like look at one. Colgate Essentials, they're four ninety nine. I tell myself what coupon I'm going to use. And then I'll always say like check CRTs, check for CRT. Okay, so CRTs is when we go in and start our shopping trip. We go to the red coupon center. It's usually straight ahead when you walk into CVS. You'll see in most any CVS, the ones in Florida were set up the same. You'll see the red coupon center. Now a savvy tip, say it's Saturday night, it's 11 o'clock and you decide, I didn't go to CVS this week, my CVS closed at midnight, like, and I'm not gonna go. Go onto your CVS app and send to card these different offers that they've sent you, because that will extend it and give you a week. Same difference, say you're out and about doing errands and you got a CVS right by you, you don't plan on shopping, but just run in and print these CRTs, cash register tapes, and that'll extend it and you'll have a whole nother week to use these. 
And then on Sunday, or for the week of starting the next day that goes into the next couponing week, you will then also get a new set of offers. So now you'll have all of these that you just sent to Carter printed and plus all the new ones. The other thing is, so Sunday morning when I get up and I'm I, after I get my paper and I'm going through my flyer, I'll go, you can go on the app, sign in and see some of these. But like, for example, it'll show you like half to two thirds of them because like this wasn't on mine. This is on my husband's uh, card. So I just want to show you guys some general ones that I did use today. Like these dollar off five toothpaste, try CVS brand, but I used them on the Colgates. You can use it on any uh, dollar off any soft soap, mm -hmm. liquid hand soap. I got a $2 off any cover girl today. Uh, I got a three off 12 pain relief. Some of my favorites because um, we are always, see there's one, tampons. So again, it's it, it just like the three off five, any diapers. Um, I love the razor ones. These will save you. So when you first start out guys, you won't get a ton. You'll get some general ones. Um, it does take a minute to build them up. So just know that. And sometimes you have to just buy that razor at full price with just the coupon without any of these. Just so CVS can start tracking you and seeing what you're buying. The more you buy, the more more CRTs that you get and the more offers you get every week. So just know that. If you're brand new to CVS or you're just learning how to coupon there, there you have it. Okay, so that was my whole point of just even doing this. Now, I'm broke this week, okay? <laughs> like, I won't lie, and that's why I was totally going to skip CVS. When I see my extra buck was about to expire, that kind of little flame under my butt, not to lose the eight bucks, and to roll it into doing some deals. You know, groceries, pantry items that we always need, and uh, I don't mind burning points at either Walgreens or my extra bucks at um, CVS to get food items or, like, essentials that are really expensive when we run out <coughs> excuse me so the first i got these all right in order my first transaction was again not going to go over every single coupon but the deodorants were like um men's or women's speed stick were buy two i got this buy two and get two dollar and fifty cent extra buck they were on sale two for five we had a dollar off two coupons, so we've left 50 cent off one coupons that came out in last weekend's 5-5 five five, uh, Smart Source. So I used one of those coupons, and then I had one of the dollar off any Speed Sticks DRT, which I think everybody got printed for them. So you stack these guys. You stack your manu manufacturer coupons with these, because this is a store coupon, not a manufacturer's coupon. So these CRTs is what makes the magic happen. And makes you save extra money. And people say they get money makers or buy something for free. This is how. And when you're calculating the offer, um, what makes it for free is when you combine this CRT, the manufacturer's coupon, and then the reward that you're getting back at the end, if that makes sense. I hope that helps. So, in all, I got two speed sticks in this transaction the soft soap. Now, I got that coupon I just showed you that was like a dollar off one liquid hand soap. So the soft soap hand soap was on sale for $1.99, all right? Um, so the hand soap was on sale for $1.99. And then, um, yeah, see the those two bottom ones, antibacterial 11.2s, they're usually $3.49. So they're on sale for $1.99. There's the price right there. And then I had that CRT and then the manufacturer's coupon that came out in 5.5. Most people got 50 cent off one, but ours set a dollar off two. So again, I almost didn't get them, but I was like, okay, Jocelyn, like $4 minus one minus $2. So I paid $1.99 for two of them and it really, $1.96 for two of them and that's pretty cheap. So I was like, fine. So I got those, and then the, one of the great deals of the week was, um, let's see, it's right here. If I move all this over, see the soft soap body wash. Now, I had a dollar off one coupon, but buy one at $3.49, you get back $1.75 extra buck, and you can do that limit of four times. So I just bought two because I had two dollar off coupons left, and then I had a $2 off of six any body wash CRT. So I stacked those. So I gave them all of my coupons. 
And after I gave all of my coupons, here's all the coupons. My subtotal was 96 cents and your ECBs will never cover tax. So you'll always have to pay tax. So that's what I paid in my debit card, $1.94 for two body washes, two hand soaps, and uh, two deodorants. And then I did go ahead and get back $3. And so if you look down here in my office, I roll mine, guys. Remember, from one transaction to the next. So I got $3.50 back. I got $2.50 back for buying the two speed sticks. And then I got $1.75 back on each soft soap, making that $3.50. And there was nothing back on the hand wash. So $3.50 and $2.50, $3.45. That was $6 to roll into my next transaction. So my secondly, I did the Aleve. I had a three off 12 pain relief. The Aleves were buy one, get one 50% off. This is literally all my store had left in the shelves. And uh, it's spend 30 and get a $10 extra care buck back. So they're buy one, get one 50 so I bought the two large ones. You can see underneath the Aleve it says original price, coupon savings, buy one, get one 50. So it shows you the two it gave 50% off. So that got me to the 30 threshold. I think it was at 32 and change. I had $4 off one coupons. And then the CoverGirl was a great deal this week because it was buy two and get any two and get a $7 extra care buck. So that's great. So I did easy breezy brow pencils because those usually make us money. And then I had a $2 off any CoverGirl CRT. I also used, we got coupons in what, the 414 Smart Source, the 428 Smart Source, and also the 55 Smart Source. And I think we've got some coming out this weekend. They all, all of those inserts have three coupons in them a $2 off any eye, a $2 off any lip, and a $2 off any face product. Okay. So go ahead and use two for the eyes. And then again, this deals every week. It might be buy two, get five. It might be buy two, but today was seven. So it's a good deal. So alone, they're $4.99 each. So let's just say $10. I had that $2 off CRT and then $2 off each eye. So right there, we're taking $6 off. So it's $3.98 for these. I'm getting back $7. So that made these free plus a $3.02 money maker. The Aleve, after my my four $4 coupons, and then my three off 12 pain relief, that's $19. I started out with 32. So that was $13 out of pocket, but I got $10 ECB back. So here is my slew of coupons. One, two, three, four, for all four of the Aleves. The $2 off, for each of the um, eyebrow, and then the $2 off the CoverGirl CRT, the three off 12 pain relief, and then I rolled my beauty buck, and my other, these are my, my ECBs for my last two, my last transaction I showed you, leaving me a subtotal of 39 cents, 79 with tax, and then I got back, oops, that's the wrong one, soft soap, we just did that one, I got $10 back for buying, it says aspirin, but it's the Aleve, and I got back $7. So this transaction, I got $17 back, and I rolled, let's see, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, $15, and I got 17 back. So again, that was a moneymaker of 302. So, I mean, that's amazing when you can get a whole six of those products and make money. Yes, thank you. Come again. Again, like I said, guys, this is super quick. Next one is on Colgate. So on the essentials, I was just really excited to try it. This one's with charcoal and then the bottom one's with the coconut oil. They have $2 off internet printables on coupons.com right now. $2 off one. On our CVS app, we have a $4 off two coupon. Make sure when you purchase these, you purchase the total SF. This deal will be happening again this week. And they're 3.4 ounce. I just don't know the exact price. These were $3.49 each this week. So I did have a one of these CRTs, which is a dollar off five toothpaste. So we use that in this transaction. I used those two internet printables and then the four off two app coupon. So this transaction looked a lot like this. Those, those were expensive, right? Originally, so they're on sale $4.99, $4.99, $3.49, $3.49. Okay, here's all the coupons I talked about. 
Colgate. That was the app coupon, the four off two. Those are my internet printables. I rolled a seven dollar extra buck, leaving me to pay two oh eight ninety six cents in tax. I got back eight dollars on this, so I rolled seven and got back eight. It's a money maker of one dollar. So yes, please and thank you. Come again. Here's my Colgate. Buy one get two. Limit was two. I got four dollars. Colgate buy one get two dollars extra buck, and the limit was two. So two times two is four. Two times two is four. Eight dollars back from that. Even the cashier was like, you are killing it today, girl. I was like, and I am broke, so I am trying to just do what I can with my ECBs. The next one, my kids hit up these Reese's, but these little share packs of eight Reese's were $1.88. Buy one, get a dollar back. So I bought that, and then my favorite makeup, the Physician's Formula, was spend 15, get 10. And whenever it's that deal, I always buy it because it tracks towards beauty, and it's just a great deal. I had no coupons for it. I had no coupons for this transaction. I just went ahead and rolled uh, $16 worth of extra bucks, paid $1.91.86 in tax, and got back. Oh, I don't like this one. We had an issue. This one didn't print, and he had to force print my $10 um, physician's formula. It was because they were on clearance. So beware of that. If something, something is on clearance, it often won't trigger our extra buck but he force printed it for me because he's amazing so the l'oreal l5 and this deal is all that happens often to spend 15 get a five dollar extra buck this was an amazing deal so i had two of the three off two internet printables i had one app coupon and one internet printable so there we are they're on sale two for eight dollars so spending 15 i bought four of them to bring me to 16 dollars i used those two three dollar coupons rolled a $10 extra buck. My subtotal was zero because again, two for eight and two for eight is 16. Two coupons is six and a $10 extra buck is 16. So I literally got $10 from Physicians Formula. I rolled that right over into the L5. So I try to plan how I do my transactions too, guys, because you will not get change on your extra bucks and they will not pay for your tax. So you want to make sure your extra buck is only for your subtotal. So when they say, oh, okay, you owe $11.12, I always say, what's my subtotal? Because you will lose that. So if he would have told me it's 11 12 and I gave him $11 in extra bucks, my $11 extra buck would have come down to 10 and I still would have owed $1.12. So I hope that makes sense. Uh, let's see here. L'Oreal, where are you, girl? Um, spend 15 get five I spent the 15 I got five so this transaction I did roll 10 and I only got five back but that's okay because I thought it was a great deal anyway so literally after getting the five dollars back and using my coupons that was dirt cheap yeah because if it was let's see two for eight and two for eight is 16 I used six dollars in coupons, so I paid five dollars. And then, so okay, wait, let's start over two for eight and two for eight, eight and eight, 16 minus six dollars in coupons is ten dollars. Okay, so this cost me ten dollars, and then I got a five dollar extra buck back. So I paid ten dollars out of pocket, but got a five dollar extra buck back. So if you add in that reward, ten minus five is five. So I paid five dollars or one dollar and twenty five cents for each bottle of L'Oreal L5. Yes, please and thank you. Come again. This is my last transaction. I had the General Mills coupons for a dollar off from two that expired on five eleven today. So I was like, always need those for the pantry. Chase was almost out for his Cheerios, so I just went ahead and grabbed four of those. And then these, I just like taking them. They do help stave off hunger and um, trying to lose the rest of the baby weight. And yeah, I just like them. They get a little energy boost. I've taken them now for about a month and a half. And they're usually like almost $20. Oh, $16.29. And they're on sale for $9.99. So I didn't mind handing over an extra buck for that. So all I used for coupons was the $2 off coupons, and then I rolled, see, here's prime example. I had a $10, a $5, and the $1 extra buck. All the rest of them that I rolled from these last transactions, and one was from the Aleve transaction, that was from the L5 transaction, and then the dollar from the Reese's transaction, and because my subtotal was $15.95, 
because we have no tax on food and that's uh is a supplement which is considered something we eat so it's considered food so there's no tax on it so because it was 15.95 do you see what i mean how that dollar went down to 95 cents it's a perfect sample i'm glad that happened so i paid zero i paid zero i didn't get anything back in this transaction which i'm fine with um so i got all of this and my grand total out of pocket was like eight dollars and 14 cents and that was just paying for tax and i got two four different things of makeup two deodorants, four bottles of Aleve, which is equals 100, 200, 300 Aleve. I'm happy to have this for the back stock. Four tubes of toothpaste. Mm -hmm. Excited to try this. Four boxes of cereal, which three kids in the household. Um, savings baby, little Che Che, only eats this. I call Chase Che Che a lot, so if you hear me say that, that's his nickname. And then the girls, that's my husband's favorite. I know it's kind of silly I'm telling you this. It's late. I'm tired. Sorry, mom brain. And it's Mother's Day. Leave me alone. Um, two soft soap body wash, two soft soap hand soaps, four shampoo and conditioners, some treats the girls already devoured, something that makes mommy feel good, and $8 out of pocket, and I, and I didn't lose my extra bucks. Um, so I'm totally to try, excited to try this BB cream and this nice new concealer. I thought I did amazing today for $8 and not letting that $8 extra buck go down the toilet because I didn't want to go. So again, guys, I know this video is pointless, but if you're just learning CVS, it was a quick overview explanation of how to roll your extra bucks, how to go in and spend very little out of pocket, make your money work for you, um, separate your transactions. Does it take me a minute to cash out with what did I do? Six or seven transactions. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, you might be there. The manager cashed me out today. His name is Cheyenne. Shout out to Cheyenne. He's amazing and I love him. And of course, my girl, Aubrey. Um, they are my two favorites. They hold my baby while they're cashing out. And, and both the manager, Cheyenne, it, that's a guy. He loves, he's a daddy. And he just loves savings, baby. Um he gave me permission to film in there. So I think this week we're going to do like a shop with me and I'll take you guys with me and show you the process of shopping using those CRTs, combining them and stacking out the CRTs with your manufacturer's coupons and then the cash out process, how I stand back and look at, okay, these are the deals that we're doing. This is how much each thing's going to be. This is how much of extra bucks I have. And this is how we're going to roll them to maximize so you don't lose any money on your ECBs because that's really important. We do these deals for that money and you don't want to just hand it over and be losing a dollar or a dollar fifty each two dollars each time because then that's not that's just not efficient guys. So again I think I had an amazing haul for eight dollars out of pocket. Now no 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 I'm not going to be that couponer that says Today, everything was free, absolutely free, because I have a magic wand. Well, no, because somewhere along the line, you paid for something, whether it was the deal that you did to earn this extra buck, or the deal you did to earn that extra buck, or the deal you did to earn that extra buck, or last week's deal that you did to earn the extra bucks that you're rolling into this week from last week. You paid somewhere out of pocket. You came up out of pocket somewhere. Everything wasn't just wave my wand free. Okay. So when you hear couponers say that, and I'm not like trying to pick on anybody by no means, I just don't want the new people that are learning to think, well, what deal are you doing? And I just don't have those coupons. So that's why I try to explain exactly like if I'm printing them from a site, if I'm getting them from an insert, I want to try to explain somebody to somebody where I got it from. Because these CRTs that we get to use are so personalized by your deal, by your shopping habits. Um, every person's are different. No two people will get the same CRTs. I mean, maybe, maybe it's possible. I'm sure it is, but it's hard. It narrows it down, guys. So it's hard to replicate to a T 
a, an exact order. Sometimes, like with the toothpaste, with I got a dollar off five toothpaste. This is a common one. Dollar off five mouthwash, common one. The shaving one's common. Every week, like this, printed for everybody. So there are some, but watching, and the more you watch other people use these, stack them with the manufacturer's coupons, the more comfortable you get with it, and the more it becomes second nature to you. And when you get these, when you first walk in, and you walk in, you've got all your coupons you know, clipped and together and paper clipped together and you've got your list of your deals and you're like, okay, I'm ready to rock. And then you walk on to, over to the coupon center and you get this list. I mean, look at this, you guys. I'm five foot one. Okay. I am five foot one. This is hitting the floor and above my head. All right. Above my head, taller than me and hitting the floor. And this is my husband's. On my card, which is my primary card, and I only usually do a few deals a week on his, so that's how many he gets. On my primary card, which is mine, I get double this, okay? So it is so overwhelming at the beginning when you think you're all good to go, ready to rock. Yeah, going to do this. And then you get this, and it just kind of throttles you because you're like, oh my God, what am I going to do now? How do I do this? I used to, and I still will here and there go in and print the day before I shop so I can just go ahead and stick these paper clip these with my deals because there's sometimes new deals that you want to do when you get like a five or a six off 20 Revlon cosmetics or you know a four off 18 hair care which I wish I had today because that would have made that almost free here I am almost free just kidding anyway um yeah so you guys get the point, you get the gist. So I don't mean to send out a pointless video, but it is just a teaching video and that's what we are all here to learn from each other. So um, happy Mother's Day in advance. Well, actually it's not really, it's like Sunday morning at 3.30. So happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Um, do something special for your mom, that loved one in your life who's like a mother figure. Um, do something special for the ladies in your life because... Moms are amazing. We sacrifice a lot for everybody that we love. So do something great for them. Even if it's just making them breakfast and not letting them do any housework all day or doing all the little things for them. Get them some flowers or pick. My favorite is getting a plant. Like I don't need a bouquet of roses. I would rather have a beautiful like hydrangea or a beautiful peony or a beautiful bas flowering basket or a beautiful hydrangea. My favorites are lilies. So give me something I can plant that I'm going to see year after year and think of you on. So there's a good tip, guys. Give bulbs or a flowering plant because then, then mom, grandma, your aunt, whoever, your sister, my sister and I swap gifts, whoever you're giving it to, give something thoughtful. Even if it's something little, just let them know how much you love them. A handmade gift would be amazing. I love making my mom fun baskets with all things that she loves. I do candles and her makeup and her special shampoo and conditioner she uses. I that, That's just me. I'm rambling. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Happy Mother's Day. And uh, share this video with a friend. And like I said, once we get up there with subscribers, I have a special gift. Um, giveaway basket I'm doing so help me get some more subscribers guys let's get up there I'm gonna do one when I get to a hundred and then we're gonna do the halfway mark and then a thousand so I'm really 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 excited I'm really glad to be on this platform guys so thank you so much for your support um, until the next one guys thank you see you later